The Missouri State Bears are 48 hours away from kicking off the 2018 season in Stillwater in our Bear Nation report. Dave Steckel will kick off his fourth season as the Bears coach with a game against the 25th-ranked Oklahoma State Cowboys. It's the second straight year that the Bears have kicked off the season against a Power 5 opponent. Last year it was Mizzou. This year, Oklahoma State out of the Big 12. The Bears will be trying to improve on last season's 3-8 record. 15 starters are back, but they'll be tested by a Cowboys squad that was 10-3 last year and ranked in the top 25 in the coaches' poll. Uh, you know, everybody says a big challenge. They're all big challenges. We're in the Missouri Valley Conference, so um, I think the kids are really uh, at a different level. We're at a different place. Um, it's going to be curious to see because obviously we got to go against the BCS team who's ranked in what, the top 25 or something like that right off the bat. And Mike does a phenomenal job year in and year out with what he has there, so every week's a challenge. The Missouri State Soccer Bears were on the home pitch last night facing Cal State Fullerton, the first home match of the season for the Valley's defending champs. Bears looking for a 2-0 start to the campaign. Titans applying pressure early. Robert Coronado would slip his way into the box, but Connor Ingram is there to poke it away and stop the attack. Later in the half, Ingram, looking for a chance of his own, beats the defender but can't get the shot past the keeper. Bears would get another chance. Under 20 minutes left in the first half, Ian Jones taken down just outside the box. That's penalty. Norwegian freshman Adni Gickling Bruseth steps up and buries the penalty kick. His first Bears goal, 1-0, but the match would end in a 1-1 tie. Springfield Cardinals wrapped up a seven-game road trip in Tulsa last night. Drillers strike bottom of the first. Jacob Scavuzzo would take this one over the fence and left. It's a two-run home run to make it 2-0 Tulsa, but Springfield would cut the lead in half in the third. Johan Miesis up to bat would drive this thing to center over the outfielder's head and off the wall out there. Tommy Edmond scores to make it 2-1. Springfield would rally to win it 5-3. Cardinals return to Hammonds Field tonight. Michael Waka will make a rehab start for Springfield. That game will start at 6.30. St. Louis and Kansas City had last night off. I'm Dan Lucy with Eurozark's first web sports.